third place game of the Class 3A Girls Soccer Tournament. The Andrew Thunderbolts playing in its first ever state tourney fell to New Trier in the semifinal. While Naperville North looks to end the season on a high note after losing the final minutes against eventual state champion Barrington the night before. North on the attack from the start, Leah Shumay with a great lead pass ahead to Megan Benmore. The senior gets a little too close to Andrew keeper Gabriella Sportinello, who makes the diving stop before Benmore can get a shot up. A few minutes later, it's Benmore again looking to get the Huskies on the board. She deftly pops the ball over Sportitello's head, but it hits the crossbar. Hannah Martin tries to knock it in, but the ball rolls out of play. Under 10 to play in the first half, Hannah Martin with a great cross to a diving Benmore going for the header, but she finds another post instead. Plenty of great chances for North, but no luck so far. Under five to go in the first half, Leah Shume with a long high corner kick. Riley Riggs goes for the header, but it deflects off her body. Caitlin Bisher has her rebound shot deflected back to Riggs. This time, her shot finds the net, and the Huskies are on the board up 1-0. Just over a minute before the break, T-Bolts with a free kick. Mia Malazzo gets off a good one that Emma Leinhardt gets a piece of, but Maddie Hosman dives in to scoop up the save. North up by one at the break. Nearing the midpoint of the second half, Megan O'Neill tries to clear the ball, but she taps it too hard. And Hannah Martin with the heads-up play to win the race to the ball, the sophomore squares up and scores her team-leading 15th goal on the season. Huskies up 2-0. After Shayna Judas draws a foul in the box, senior Caitlin Busher puts the exclamation point on the season and her career with the PK goal to the lower left-hand side. Naperville North wins the third place game 3-0 the first state trophy for the Huskies since 2013, and the ninth in the program's illustrious history. Our forwards generated a lot of chances. The midfield won the 50-50 balls, the restarts, got it out, got it up, and the back line didn't give anything up, and Maddie Hausman did her job. What can you more exactly. ask for? Yes, yeah. I couldn't be prouder of everyone on the team. I love each and every one of my teammates and our coaches, and it's, we've been so successful this season. Everyone underestimated us, but um, we knew our potential, and we finally brought it to finish third is amazing. So. Yeah, I mean, if you look at us from the beginning of the year, we we didn't really expect this, uh -huh. um, but we really bonded as a group and you see it, we play together and we really play for each other. We're really committed to covering for each other or making sure we get another step so we can be open to like help the person next to us. And we all really like, we're so connected, we love each other, we hang out a lot af outside of practice and stuff like before games, the night before we all go to Noodles and have dinner together and hang out and watch movies together. So we're really connected this year.